Everybody, Evan Michael here in the Photobacks office. Wanted to talk to you a little bit about these incredible new specials we have for you for Black Friday through Cyber Monday. I hope you're taking advantage of them, but most importantly, want to show you, I mean, I think all these are fantastic depending on what you need, but I do want to go over our latest new package. This is the Modern Century package. Normally, we're going to sell this for probably at least double this, if not more, of course, probably anywhere from $70 to $100 for this on sale. So to get this for $33, bucks, special introductory price, just launched it on Friday, but it is so good. There is so much you can do with this, and I want to demonstrate it in Photoshop really quickly because I've been using it since before it's, it got launched just so we could test it, and uh, it's, it's just amazing. Let me show you something like this one. So this is a wide format. All right, let's go to the wide format templates here. Here. Let me find that one because I want to show you what can change and how easy it is to customize these templates perfectly for you inside of Photoshop depending on the image that you have. What's so important about Photobacks, as you may already know, is that we can customize everything. We're not stuck with anything. So we're giving you the ingredients to make the images that you want. You don't have to keep it this way. These are just ingredients to build the image, the product, the layout, the design, the book, whatever you're creating, whatever you're going to print, whatever you're going to put online, the social media, whatever it is. You want to add text to this, you can customize it, and that's the advantage. Nothing is set in stone, but watch how easy it is, how much faster we can do this than from building it from scratch. So over here where it says Photo Mask, I'm going to click that, and I'll click in Photo Mask Control. This is our plugin, which is included with all of our products. So you get this. So let's click this. Add photo, and let's find a photo we want to use. Something like this one here. And then I'm going to put this in and I'll customize this just so you can see. Okay, so there's the image we want to use. Very easy, very fast. This would take you a long time to set up without this template. Even if you turned off all these other layers and just did that, that would take you 20 minutes versus it took me five seconds. But let's have fun with the rest of this. Watch what we can do. Number one, we can go through each one of these layers. This is... Part of the Modern Century package that makes it so great is that these are shape layers and color pickers. Sometimes you find some raster layers that we can adjust with our Photobacks Control plugin. But if you see these little icons next to these layers in the Modern Century package, or any package, but this one has so many, you can change the color so easily. So watch what I do. I can double click one of these. The color picker box comes up and then I just click on a color in the photo. And I find something that just kind of works or matches and I run down this. Now this one is a raster image. It's not a shape layer or anything. So we just use Photobacks Control to click on color and then I'll click another color from the image. That works. It basically put the color in the right tone. Here's the circle. I don't know where it is. So let's click on that. Let's say some just part, some color in the image. And I'm just gonna kind of click around and I'm just getting all new colors here. Just look at this. I'm not even paying attention. But if you do this, all of the colors, you just click to find something you like, all the colors match and work perfectly because they're all coming from your photo. So all I'm doing is double clicking and then clicking on colors in the image. And look at what we can do here. And then you can actually click and drag and pick a color that you like. So if you want to just see different colors as you go over your image and just get something like that and we're, we're perfect. It, like, it matches your photo perfectly. Let's duplicate this with Photobacks Control just so we can uh, have a copy of it. I'm gonna close this out and open it again to show you the original here and what it looked like. So you can see the difference in the colors. So there's subtle changes, it worked great, but with my photo, boom, it matches perfectly. So that's before and that's after. So now we have all those colors. Let's do the exact same template, but just a different photo and show you what I would do. So let's add a photo here and let's find one with totally different colors and a total different image. So let's say this one here has got you know, purple in it. So that could work great. Something like that. This could be a great profile image, something for online, a website. You could add text to this, maybe a photo book. You know, there's so many different ways to use this. Okay. So there's our image. Let's go through it again. I'm going to double click the frame. Let's just click on something else just like that. And let's click on this here. We'll click maybe that purple will be great in the background. Let's click on a circle here, something like that. We'll just keep doing it till we find the colors that work perfectly for this image. And I like to make them a little different. So if I find one that's too similar, I'm just finding, you know, different colors in the image that work well. Like that maybe. And then you can always go back and change them. Maybe you want to make this a different color, etc. We do something like that, you know. Okay, kind of like what we had, just wanted to show you. And then the background. Maybe we'll make this background a little darker just to do something totally different. You know, or like that, boom, right? So look how fast I'm done. Then I can still adjust. Maybe this is a little too harsh, right? Or I want this to be a little lighter to match the background. So you have to get it right in the first try. But look at how gorgeous that is. Set, done, done. 
Like how long would that take you to do? And by the way, because it's photo effects, because you're working in Photoshop, you have the ability to customize this any way you want. Now we can, let's duplicate it and let's do some different sizes. So when you go to checkout at, at the checkout, we have a, a special offer if, if you don't have it yet, but it's a video guide that'll explain what I'm about to show you, which is how to customize any template for any size document. But let's say I wanna make this square. So I'm posting this on social media, or I have a square spot, maybe like on an email or something, I wanna put an image in, and this is your profile image. I can go to my crop tool and then under the ratio, do a one-to-one -one square, and then there it is. Now, at the very top, I don't have delete crop pixels selected. I don't wanna delete anything, so I wanna leave that off, but then I wanna crop, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and just turn off some of these layers just to get an idea of what else we can do here. This looks pretty good, but I'm just wondering if this is a little bit too much or too big, or if I can bring in some of these circles. So I'll grab this guy here, and just kind of move it in a little bit and resize it just to get it, maybe I want them all on the canvas. I don't want them going off the page, how about that? So this is just redesigning this, yeah, it looks pretty good. Redesigning this to fit the new canvas, you know, something like that, okay? And then this, we'll turn this one back on. And then I think I just wanna lighten this up a bit. So hue and saturation, just using Photobass Control makes it so easy, like that, just a bit. So this is before and that's after. And I could even make this part a little bit bigger now for the canvas. So maybe I just want to increase the size, make sure this is all centered, just like that, move her back. There we go, perfect. So I'm able to customize this exactly the way that I want, in the exact shape I want, the exact format I want. Now I'm gonna close out the others because I wanna show you another final little thing on this, which is, let's close that. I can duplicate this now. I can tile these on the screen and I'll just zoom out a bit on both of them, but I can make multiple copies of this just to get an idea of what else might look good. Maybe I wanna try the background in a different color, right? So I do something like that. And then maybe I don't even want this on. I just wanna see what it looks like without that. Or maybe I don't like this background color, so now we'll do something a little, you know, more like that. So I have different variations of this and look at how fast I was able to do this. It takes me seconds and this is what it's all for. So if maybe this back one needs to be a little different color like that. So, and then we can duplicate things, we can change things. It's all here for you inside of Photoshop, customizable, ready to go. These are your ingredients to making your apple pies. Like you guys may have heard me say before, these are the ingredients to making an apple pie. We don't wanna start with the farm. We wanna to go to the store, get the ingredients, build what we want, or just buy the pre-made apple pie. That's exactly what this is. So. It's really a no-brainer. When you really start working inside of Photoshop, you really want to enhance your images, your abilities. You want to enhance what you're offering your clients, family, or friends. There's just no better way to do this, and the quality is 100% just professional, high-end, beautiful. Like, everything about it just looks amazing. And this is just the Modern Century package. You can do this with sports, you can do this with weddings, you can do this with portraits and seniors and everything else. So anyway, all right, that's my uh, little showcase here of the new Modern Century package. I don't think you should hesitate. For 33 bucks, I would grab it now before it's double that price or more. I usually only sell them for about 67 to $97 on sale. So definitely grab this one. It's a huge savings. I think you'll have a lot of fun with this. You can do so much with this package. Scroll through this whole page and you'll just see everything in here. I only showed you just a little tip of the iceberg here, but these are just absolutely fantastic. Just gorgeous stuff. And again, all this fully customizable in the exact same way, no matter what images you use. All right, everybody, have a great weekend. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.